need a platform to express their voices, ideas and concerns. As policy makers, what better platform could we give them than the Parliamentarians Group of Children? I hope that this exercise that we do today will help us in furthering the right of a child to speak. I especially want to thank all, all the, the young people who have so much energy and, and so much commitment to the cause of children themselves. Um, so I'd like to appreciate that and really um, thank you on behalf of UNICEF, all of you for taking the time to, to be here and to give us this opportunity. What really matters are a little more vision from the system and insight from the society. There are myths about blindness, but the ignorance, even at the top level, hurts more. When a system accommodates more, it gains. Shouldn't we go for enriching our system? Thank you. I beg you all to take care of 40% population who are defenseless children like your own child. To make India strong and more powerful because children are the nation builders of tomorrow. Long way we have come since 2015 when this group was launched to today when these children got an opportunity to voice their opinions they actually represent a cause or their region or a particular group of interests of children. Today, here, seeing all of you parliament members here and considering everything that these kids have to say and listening to them and of course, I am sure that there will be lots of take backs from here. It makes me feel very hopeful about how much better the future can be for children. We have opened our eyes all the time. It's not that we don't know anything. पर बच्चों से सुनना ये बहुत बड़ी बात है आज हमारे लिए जैसे उसने बोला कि आज सोते वक्त आप जरूर सोचना तो हम जरूर आज सोचने पे मजबूर हो गए ऐसे मुझे लग रहा है। We heard them today, we heard some problems, we heard your expressions. It is you who taught us, the students who were explaining the facts and figures from your experience. You have given us a lot of lessons. It's indeed a very rich interaction. The children covered much larger and topics which are looming over the nation, nutrition, health, child labor, child abuse. But they also pointed us, enlightened us about some specific issues. Blind himself, Saundari Pradhan, opened my eyes on the issue of, specific issue of scribe having to be younger than them. Not logical at all. This is something we can take up in the parliament achieve. And thank you for telling us your stories. Thank you for giving us your insight about what um, needs to happen here in India, in your states, but also nationally. UNICEF will stand with you on that journey. We will speak out too, we will campaign, we will run programs, we'll support what you do. And over the next decade or so, I think we will make progress on the issues that you have talked about today. But it will take hard work, as Sachin Tendalka said, it will take resilience, it will take determination to take to make the type of change that you have I've talked about today so